Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Liz. What's going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So, the 2022 FIFA World Cup has begun. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. All right. So, Qatar versus Ecuador, right, folks? Um, honestly speaking, uh, I was really disappointed with Qatar, the way they play, folks. Sure. I'm not sure what happened here. Um, so, let's look a couple things over here folks right one their goalkeeper Saad al Sheep. I'm sorry if I said the name wrong um, he didn't play well right the penalty which was taken right was actually a really weak penalty folks right so Saad al Sheep. I'm not sure he decided to just choose sides he did not really analyze where the penalty taker was going to kick the ball. I think he was just choosing sides. Um, he went the wrong side, which is fine, but um, that was a weak penalty, folks. And if he would have done um, a little bit of homework on that, he could have stopped that penalty. There was really very little power in that penalty, right? To the second goal too, folks, right? So Qatar's defense was not the best, right? And the goalkeeper, again, Saad al Sheep could have come up front quickly to scare um, the person who scored the goal, but he just did not, okay? So pretty tough day for him, the goalkeeper, tough day for Qatar. Um, another thing I wanted to add real quick, yeah, let me know what you all think about this. Qatar's passes were not good today, folks. I don't know what happened. Their passes were just not accurate. They had a difficult time giving passes to each other and even controlling the ball. They just did not do it, all right? Um, they got to play Senegal. Good luck. They got to play Netherlands. Uh, it's going to be a tough a road for Qatar uh, in the next few days. But let me know what you all think about this, folks. Hey, Niz, uh, the goalkeeper was incredible. I disagree with you to Qatar's passes were great um, and there is nothing to improve here. But let me know what you all think about this and please put your comments at the bottom and please subscribe. Take care now. Bye bye.